Hey all, welcome to today's video. So um, today I'm going to talk a little bit about my uh, camera setup and my video camera setup that I use. Because I don't use a GoPro like a lot of others. I use um, this little fella called a TomTom Tom Bandit. So this is it. But yeah, so it's a fab little uh, action camera. Uh, the only thing you've got to do to make it waterproof is put the new lens ca cap on it, waterproof lens cap. But other than that, it comes already waterproof down. So a uh, good bit of kit. Um, then my lighting that I use is this guy here. So a nice powerful video light off of Amazon. And as you can see, it's extremely powerful. And we also have red light, flashing red light, and a blue light. So it's a fab bit of kit. Um, these are sealed 60 meters also. Enclosed batteries. So they take the um, 18650 batteries, four of them. So I always have um, a set in there and I've got a spare set in my case. Uh, it's double o-ring sealed, uh, so it's nice and tight, and then it's just a, a screw back on. Like so, and it's got the ball connector already on it, so when I clip it onto my frame, it's all ready to go, and good to go. So, a bit more about the camera. Um, I'll, this is, as I say, the TomTom Tom Bandit. Looks like this. Okay, it's got movable, you can move it on the angles like this, already built in. It's got a um, special clamp here, so it can take different fittings, a squeeze option to release. Um, I got it so it's using a standard GoPro fitting. And then you just squeeze it in, locks into place then, then you've got a standard GoPro fitting, like so. Twist the back off. The unique thing about this, this is your battery. Um, it's your memory card holder. It takes micro uh, SD card. And basically, it's that's the brains of the, of the unit. So that just pops out of there. Like that. And it's nice and simple. Um, which I find makes it a great bit of kit. So I've just got the O-ring on there um, to keep it sealed. So what we do... Pop the memory card inside, then this slots in the back, and then it is a simple on the top here. Rotate and it locks into place, so that's now secure and watertight. Now, I was talking about the lens at the front, so pop that off. So, it comes with the standard lens that comes with it, it comes with little holes in it. Um, so, or the lens cover comes with little holes in it. Uh, and that's for the sound, but obviously we don't want holes when we're diving, otherwise um, it will get flooded. So you get one of these, a little waterproof version, and again it's similar to the front. You line it up like that, and then it's a twist to lock. Okay, and that's a lock. That's that. Brilliant. Powered on at the back here. There we go, and that's it, ready to film. So, you can go through the menu using the controls at the top. So you can select your audio, uh, your video, sorry. What angle you want it, normal or wide angle. And your size, and it goes right up to 4K, which is great. Go back through images so this is the great thing with the diving so you've got scene selection and it's got an underwater selection for it, it has got other other ones your other sort of standard ones but for diving switch on to the underwater um, setting for video as well 
then um, it automatically does the filler. So there's no need for red fillers. Okay, and you've got the rotation. So you can uh, rotate the the images within as well, depending on how you've got it set up on you. But your standard for me. Okay, and as you can see, there's loads more settings within. It's also got Wi-Fi connectivity on it. Um, uh, where you can connect up remotes or sensors. Sound, language, units, etc. That's for the memory card. And that gives you the about information within it. So, and status. So that gives you all the, the info that's going on in the camera right now. And what everything's set up to be so you get quick access to it so when you're when you're filming with this one of the unique things that i really like about it is if i press it to start filming oh get the double beat what it does is you can see on the back there it starts uh starts filming okay now this button on the back as well as starting to film it if you're diving and you see a particular fish or something like that what you can do is you can hit that button and that I'll do that again so you can see in the screen gives a new highlight so what happens when you're you stop it filming what happens when you're um downloading all the um the video using tom tom's um software which i'll talk about in a second then um, the highlights are in there, so you can automatically um, create a story using just the highlights that you pinpointed throughout. It'll also create its own highlights depending on what's happened. Um, uh, so yeah, it, it's really, really, really good bit of kit. Um, you can set your speed. Um, that's the GPS. It's got built-in GPS with it as well. Which is pretty cool. Back to the that slow motion, time lapse, nightscape. So there's loads and loads of cool options within it. You've got burst mode, continuous mode, etc. So you've got loads of options that. But that is the camera I use for all my video. And um yeah, it's fab bit again. Just have a look at some of the videos I've popped on YouTube. Um, a couple of the videos that I've put on from diving and you'll see that the quality of it is brilliant really really good so the software one of the problems with it is it's a discontinued uh, Tom Tom discontinued it after um, they made it for some reason I don't know why so you can actually pick these up fairly cheap uh, now I think I picked this one up for about 70 quid which <laughs> can't complain at um, but because of that, the software, um, TomTom's own software, they don't produce it anymore. So what you've got to do to get the app on your phone, you need to, you can just Google um, TomTom Bandit software, or, or Android, for example, um, .apk, to get the APK file. You then download that to your phone, select your phone to trust um sources from outside of the play store and then install the apk file and it'll download the software straight to your phone um and it works really well and you can link this up via um wi-fi to your phone and download all the the uh, video um to get the software similar thing um online you just do a search for tom tom bandit uh, download and you'll find it. The, the the files are out there. Just download them to your laptop or computer, and um, yeah, you can then use the uh, software uh, included with it. Uh, I will do another video, um, sort of looking at the software and what it can do. But for now, that was an insight into what I use to do my diving videos. Hope you enjoy, and if you are enjoying my videos, don't forget to um, click the subscribe button to get notified when there's more. Cheers now. Oh,